Hello. Hi, everybody. Hi, John. We're having such a great time, aren't we, Rachel? We're having a great time. We just had yep. cake. Yep. And so now Night we're cake. all jazzed. Yeah, We've got the hyper. sugar rush. Yeah. So this is going to go fast and furious. Um, I brought some things to show you that you might want to purchase. Rachel was so gracious to have me bring some things so you could have a piece of, of the excitement. And also, I went looking around Rachel's store. And she had some hidden wonderful things here that I don't think she even realized. So I wanted to show them to you because I know you can't maybe come to Denver to be in her store, but we can bring her store to you. That's what so, we're doing right yeah, now. I yeah. feel like we're on QVC, That's right. but the most beautiful set yeah. in the world. And we are doing live teddy bear shopping. Yeah. So how does our live teddy bear shopping work? Well, it's not like selling a vacuum cleaner, I'll tell you that no. right now. <laughs> but what I'm going to do is because we have been fast and furious videotaping for you for the January show, I didn't get a chance to unpack my suitcases or any of the bags. And I've just got some stuff from Rachel's store. So what we're going to do, I'll do it all at the same time. So I think what we'll do is I'll hold it up. If you want it, you can mark sold. Or you can contact me um, then through jpport at earthlink.net. You know where I'm at. I'm on Ruby Lane and everywhere else. I'll ship it when I get home. And I'm going to include the shipping. Europe's a little bit different. I may have to add some shipping if we do it to Europe. But I think that's what we'll do. And um, it'll just be fun. If nobody's interested in shopping today, that's okay. I just want to show you some of these pieces. And it's nice to look through Rachel's store and pull out some great things. I am excited because John has curated some of his top picks from our store. So I am, I, it's, it's, I can't wait. Okay. So he knows so much more about these things than I do. So it's, it's a treat. So if you want to purchase something, we will put the email and all of the information you need, but you can say sold on the video to claim it. And we hope you enjoy this. Yeah, so are we fun. starting with my stuff or your stuff? Let's start with your stuff. Do okay. We have the um, piece de resistance that I saw earlier. Did you bring that over? Oh, uh, Eric, can you please bring yeah. the monkey? And I, now they know it's a monkey. Thanks for spoiling that, Rach. But anyway, um, I want you to know, because I'm a kind and loving person, Can you I am giving you first chance at these things. If you don't want them, or they are coming home with me, because these are really special things. But I wanted you to have first chance, because it's exciting to have you with us and to have the joy that we have for you. Okay. So, so first of all, I'm going to show you this. This is a Stife monkey. He, you can see where his button was in his left ear. It's missing. However, when I picked him up, it's very interesting. I have two or three of these in my collection, but mine are all disjointed. This monkey is very exciting. He's rod jointed. He has the wire that goes from the arms and the wires that go from the legs. His head I believe has the disc joint, but I bet you anything there's something that goes up through here too. He's very early. More than likely, he had an elephant button in his ear from about 1904. And that's the Holy Grail. It's the Holy Grail, guys. And he's in great condition. The only thing that I see that's wrong is just this little repair here. But you know what? That's not a difficult repair to take care of. I mean, it doesn't destruct. I would probably even leave it, just do some stitches. But all in all, look at the felt on his face. Look at this guy. He's so cute. He is just magnificent. He really does and, look like... And he's 2200 which is such a good deal. I mean, the last one I've seen for sale that had the rods in it, I... I know Rosemary and Paul Volpe had one, and it went for far, far more than that. So these are some of the earliest of the Stipe toys with the rods that joint the arms and the legs. After that, they were discs. The ones I all have have the cardboard discs and cotter pins. This is the early rod joint that goes through. I wonder if I can show you. See the metal that goes through into the arms? Awesome. He is just wonderful. Paula, he can come home and he can be yours. He's a truly a special, special monkey. Very early, very exciting. Oh, thank it was you. so nice to see him on the shelf and say, what a great well, thing. Well, Billy just bought the rod monkey. Well, <laughs> Billy. <laughs> 
<laughs> Yay for Billy! Now I know what I'm getting for Christmas. <laughs> well, I love you, Bill, and I know I'm, I'm going to treasure it. Okay, well, okay, so that was exciting. That was exciting. And that was such a, 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 a super, super piece. Well, thank and, you for finding him. Oh, and then another one that I fell in love with. Look at this. This was in a case down there, back in the corner. This, look at this dog. First of all, look at the shape on this dog. This German dog, early, I'd say about 1890, 1910. The head comes off, he's a candy container. Look at that face. Yeah. He's only 895. I was shocked because you see a lot, I've seen a lot of candy containers. Rabbits, cats, dogs. Look at this. Collie, I mean, it's just, the detail in his face is just fantastic. Aww. I thought this was one that I definitely had to share with you guys. You just don't see them very often. And his tail, and he's in beautiful, beautiful condition. Look at that. Oh, it's so fun to see John's pics oh. from my shop and him oh, look at this. telling you about them. He, uh, be beautiful. I mean, the skin, it, there's skin. no break in the skin. I mean, over the cardboard and the wood legs. And look at those eyes. Look at that. <laughs> He's so that wonderful. That is a dog that, I mean, you're never going to find one of these. I've seen a lot. This is the first one I've seen in the collar. He's doll size. He'd be great with a French fashion or a nice German doll. He's, he's really magnificent. So I just wanted to share him with you because he really is special. Thank you for showing him. So if you're here with us, let us know. We are doing live shopping. So John has two suitcases here full of wonderful treasures. You're spending the afternoon with us shopping treasures. Yeah. How, this is fun. So and then fun. Look at this. Okay, you ready? Let's bring them in a little. All right. Next, a little 10-inch Stife. Look at the <laughs> face. He's so cute. Oh, he's so wonderful. And look, he's got his original button. It's an FF button. And he's in beautiful condition. Look at his pads. He's wonderful. Look at that. And when I saw the price, I thought, oh my gosh, he's only $9.50. He's less than a thousand for a 10 inch and his squeaker still works and it has not been repaired. This is the squeaker he got when he was born. He's just so incredible. I mean, what a treasure. Look at the 10 inches. 10 inches was one of the most popular sizes of Stife Bears in the early 1900s. It was a great size for a child to hold. He's really awesome. Then, Do not be afraid to comment, even if you're wind. I we're window shopping. Window shopping yeah. is always encouraged. We comment with shop. what you love and share yeah. the video. That helps us it's out. It's nice a lot. to share it. Yeah. This guy, I found him in here. He's wonderful. He's early American. I'd say he's between 1910 and 1920. And what I love about these bears, they were done a lot of these in sweatshops in New York, small factories, and they were sold to places like Ward's, Sears, and. They just remind me of the 4th of July. You can just see this guy sitting on an old tin drum with a hat on and a horn. And look at his pads. He's in such great condition. A lot of people call these the football style bears because his body is football style. Many different companies did these. He's only 250, which I was shocked. It's a great price for a bear of this age. And all original, all mint and all original. He's just really wonderful. So, you know, if you play this back later on, you can contact Rachel for her pieces because they will be here waiting for you. Yes. Unless I decide to take them home myself. So I'm being well, nice. I'm he, giving you a first chance. He did bring a van. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Empty van. I this saw the guy, van pull up and I said, oh, that's got to be John Port. This guy is wonderful. These, I believe, were American. I've had them in several different sizes and several different colors. They, I've had one in actually green. I have one now in like a blue-gray. I've had them in a cinnamon color, white. I have a picture of a little girl holding these style bears. This guy's huge. He's like 20, 21 inches, maybe even, oh, he's probably 21, 22. He, look at this face with those big ears, his original glass eyes. He's only $800. I mean, her prices, I was surprised. But look at this. Perfect. Perfect pads. Look at this. 
He has really withstood the test of time. And look at that face. So these early American bears, a lot of them are rarer than the Stuyves, actually, Rachel, because the companies didn't last as long, maybe two, three years. We had an economic slowdown in 1908. So a lot of them, the companies just couldn't handle it, and they closed up shop. Also, mohair was in short supply. Excelsior companies, you know, were in short supply. So a lot of these disappeared. Where Stuyves came on, a lot of the early American companies were only a matter of a few short years. Mm -hmm. So they're very rare. Mm -hmm. People just don't realize how rare they are. So he's a very special guy. He's got a cute little face. He does. He's perky. He is perky. Then, for all our cat lovers, I found this little gray American cat. <laughs> Look at this. I love with her outfit. With this little kitten with her mittens. And she's got a little blue dress on and her tail. Look at her tail sticking out of the and back of the dress. And it's got a little, like, yeah. <laughs> That's not appropriate, Rachel. Oh, well. Please don't pull the kitty's tail up. We shouldn't look under kitty's dress. But look at her little tongue. Her little tongue, it's still there <laughs> after all these years, and her beautiful glass eyes. And she's $125. Isn't she wonderful? Kitten, one of the kittens that lost her mittens, well, she's here. Look at that. I wish I had John all the time to do my curating. I know, I wish. And pricing and, and everything and repair. Well, I'm only two and a half days away, Rachel. <laughs> I can commute. Okay, so those are some of the picks out of, oh, I forgot one more thing, a couple more things. Got too excited. Look at this little fur cat. You know how you see the little fur dogs a lot and they put them with French fashions and things like that? Very seldom do you see these little German fur um, kitty cats that were done in the 20s and you know somewhere about there up into the 30s and look at the fine detail look at her feet and her little tiny eyes and mouth look at that she's 125 dollars, and i think she may go home with me because i'm in love with this kitty she's fantastic oh no never mind valerie bought it oh valerie bought the kitty Oh, another Christmas present coming another my way, Christmas Rachel. Present for John. Oh, my friends are shopping for my presents. <laughs> and look, it, it's almost that time, Thanksgiving, where we give thanks and we stuff ourselves so full that we can't move the next day. So everybody needs a Stife Tucky Turkey. And he's $150. And he could be yours for the center of the table as a free giveaway when I come for your Thanksgiving. Isn't he wonderful? He's so One proud. of my favorite, and the neat thing about this, look, Rich, he's still got his Aww. flag and his button. So, he's so cute. Very look at his little rare. Look at his little stick legs. Oh, she Billy wants us to show the dog again. Yeah, that's a great dog. Oh, this is phenomenal. This is really. I mean, look at the detail. Look at this. I mean, look at the coloring in the fur. He's just so. Incredible, look at this. Look at the condition on the inside. Just really super. Look at his legs. No breaks. The, the, the skin is just super. Really, really wonderful. Could you repeat the price of the cat the as well? I believe the cat in the, in the the cat blue in the dress, dress was 125? 125, yeah. Okay, if we don't respond to you, first of all, I'm half blind. Oh, Valerie just bought the dog. Well, Valerie, congratulations. Valerie, sorry, Billy. Beat her up. <laughs> you can do it. Give her a really nasty phone call and hang up. Okay. So now we get to go into John's. So now I will open some of my cases. And we'll yes. go through this fast because we have so much more content for the convention to shoot. We'll be here all day. You know what? Shopping is so fun, though. Oh, I just expanded it. Two suitcases full of stuff. So get ready and some i just brought i just wanted to show you because i love antique photos of children with their bears you don't see them very often so i just wanted to bring them to show you okay first of all i'll bring oh. up the big guy oh my goodness this guy is big oh great color in fact i'm gonna get out my little cheat sheet because i didn't take the time to price everything i just put them on a list he's german from the 1920s now the neat thing about him if you look at his nose, see his nose? It has a very special shape. He's missing a couple threads, but if you look the little down part, there was a company called, that was made by Stefan Kreitlein, small company in Germany, and Pansy was their toy, 
was their toy name, their logo, I guess you'd say. You don't see them very often. They advertise that they stuffed them with feathers. I've had several cart lines with the tags. I have never seen a feather in any of them. So I don't know if that was just a marketing ploy. But um, yeah, here we go. He is 24 inches tall and he's on consignment. I just got him. He's only $1,000. That includes the shipping. That is such yeah. a great pr look at yeah. this wonderful. Only problem he's got, His he's got a little worn. He's great, perfect, but somebody has held him and patted his popo. So the only thing he's got is a bear patch right there. Oh. And I think what it was, somebody just held him and they either, it was yeah. comforting just to tug on his fur or they just patted his popo bald. So anyway, he's a Stefan Kreitlein. It was Pansy Bear. It was Pansy Toy Company in Germany in the 1920s into 30s. Yeah. He is so yeah. sweet, John. Yeah. I love him. And he's a great big size. He's awesome. Yes. You don't see him very often. Are you having fun virtually shopping with John and I? Okay, I'm this, having fun. This is an early American teddy bear. It's 12 inches. And the neat thing, you, the way you tell an early American bear, they used to do five claws. One, two, three, four, five. Later on, it was four for time and expense. You wouldn't think that it's that much time or expense less, but it was. So the earlier bears, I'd say around 1907, 1906, were always five claws. And he's in great condition in his little um, midi, and he is 385. So he's oh. 1907, early American company. A sailor, he's gonna <clears throat> steal your heart. And he is 385. 385, what a great Isn't deal. Great? If you want the sailor, Click Sailor Sold. He is so sweet, John. It's fun to show him. I really love showing him. Okay, I'll just zip you around here. If you're here with us, you have, this is a first, you are in the first row to seeing John's brand new inventory that he brought for this virtual show that we are having right now. So we love having you here with us. Oh. It is. It's fun. I just so love fun. showing it. If you want to take something home, that's great. If not, I don't care. I just like showing it. It's so fun. <clears throat> this is really cool. This is a Cook's teddy bear. You could, let's see if I can just show it here. <coughs> Excuse me. It is printed cloth. These were done in about 1907. And you could cut them out and put them together and make a teddy bear. It was a printed teddy bear. And this is $125, which I know I probably paid a fortune for. It's out of my collection. And it's really neat. You could even copy this on mohair, and it really does make a nice bear when it's made up. But to think this survived. Yeah, that is so cute. You could frame that and put it on the wall. It would be great framed. So Cook's Teddy Bear. Yeah, and they were um, done in about 1907 and not didn't last too long, maybe a year or two. That is delightful. Isn't that wonderful? Would oh, you like a you. drink? I would. We're getting I talk very, too much. We're getting very excited. So this is this is so fun. I love that. And here, oh. Rachel had a little 10 inch. Oh my <clears> gosh, <throat> so cute. This is a little eight inch. On the eight inch, they didn't put paw pads in. Still has this little FF button and his paw pads. And he's 900. What he's a steal. perfect, perfect condition. What a steal. Yeah. These were done in 19, that. about 1908. Look at the little button right there. This is everything you would want in a little eight inch style. 1908? 1908. What yeah. a wonderful bear. Isn't he great? Oh, he's great. She, she, he, that's, she has this little, that's what they have necklace. to tell you. This is a great buy. Uh, yeah. Oh, so the really wonderful. You have the 10 inch and an eight inch. You can start your own sliding scale of teddy bears. Here's the 10 inch and the little eight inch. They're just wonderful. And then another thing I just Well, love. Valerie just said sold. Valerie, oh. is this for this wonderful eight inch? Because this is a fabulous bear. Oh, I love him. I almost just bought him, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> John's been buying lanterns. I, I, I know, I'm buying furniture here. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to purchase my entire cabin. Well, you can't. Oh, so, my gosh. How cute is one that? One thing I absolutely love in Stifes are things that were played, actual play toys. 
something just... Oh, that's... Oh, okay. If you lose the feed, everybody, just refresh. It's usually your okay. internet. This is a Stein oh Rattle, white, with his original button, and he's 900. Oh, my goodness. Can you imagine the little kid that rattled him and he survived? No. Look at that. Look at his little pot belly. Yeah. And he's, and he's white. You don't see the white ones very often in good condition. And let's face it, they were a child's toy. So they just didn't last. I've had the rattles that hang over the crib, and I think some little baby would have shoved that in its mouth. But to think they survived is really exciting. Anyway, and he still rattles. I love how pronounced his button yeah. is. Look at this, everybody. He's a, He's got the big button. Look. So he's probably from around 1912 or later. Oh, my God. And how much is he? He's 900. He's 900. Yeah. Oh, he's wonderful. He's just got his little smug little face. Isn't he fantastic? Oh, I love it. So as we go through, everybody, tell us what your favorite things are. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's wonderful. I mean, it's just, it's neat to see some of these things. You can see him right there you in know? the end. Oh, no. I'm, yeah. First of all, we're collectors out there, yeah. so we love to shop, yeah. even if it's window shopping. And we're yeah. learning so much. No, I just, I love to see everything. This, I think, this is a, a consignment piece. I love piece, this. And this is so cute. It's German. Get out of here with this. And look at this face. <laughs> it lost you. Oh, we're oh, back. We're back. We're okay. back. Okay, look at this face. It's a German puss in boots with his orange boots. Look at the tail. He's mohair. And... His cape, the this... original hat, and he's four ninety five. Isn't he fantastic? I, I don't. I've only seen one other of these probably around twenty years ago in green. But look at the face on this. It almost has so that stiff type cute. face. Look at the airbrushing. Isn't that incredible? He's not jointed. He's an actual. You know, he's standing there, like puss in boots. Look at those boots. I love these them. are so fashionable. Kais, are these like? These are fashion. These are like riding boots. Yeah. Kaiser Isn't that great? Awesome. But I just love showing this face. Look at those Oh, I eyes. love the orange. The awesome. orange is wonderful. Just so cool. Okay. And let's see what we got next. This guy is really oh, special. Oh, what a great this face. This is a, a Shuko from the 1920s, early 30s. Look at this. Look at this bright, bright, burnt gold mohair and he's had a few repairs on his feet and I'm going to show you later um we're gonna see how they did that so the old felt is over the repair so you get to keep the original felt with newer felt underneath isn't that awesome one of the programs yeah. that John is doing for us is showing us how to repair a teddy bear some tips and yeah. tricks and ideas and ideas, you know, you don't have to do it all, but you have a little bit of, gives you an idea of what to do. And, yeah. how, and how much was he? He's 800. He's wonderful. Isn't he super? Yes. He's just so He's cute. so super. He's so awesome. Okay. And this guy, I just, I'm in love with. This little five inch stife. Look, he's early. He's probably around. He's got glass eyes. Let's see. Yeah. He's got glass eyes, so he's probably the teens to the 20. Oh, Look at so him cute. in the five inch size with his original FF button. Julie uh, Ju Julie oh. wanted to know how this works, so Julie's on here. Um, hey Julie, how yeah, are hey, you? Yeah, hey Julie. So if you see something you love, you can you comment sold and then what it is. Yeah. And then we will know that it's sold. Yeah. Otherwise anyone can buy it. Yep. And you buy it through contacting us and you just pay us the yeah. same so way. So just put sold. Yeah. Puss and boots, sold, sold and boots. little stife. Sold. Sold. I just everything. want everything. See, we think yes. the same. Yes, we do. So this is a little five-inch stife. He's probably from around 19, the teens to the 20s. And I love the looks on these. Look at his oh, little grumpy so face. Oh, Look at those is. little glass eyes. He's giving you the side eye. And he's four ninety five. dollars These prices include oh, shipping, deal. by the way, just so you know. Unless the bigger items are going to Europe, we'll have to, we'll have to you know, add a little bit more, but everything's free if it's shipped in the United Look States. Look at his little Tom Toms. He's had some money. Oh my gosh. Isn't For $500, you can get such yeah. a fabulous little bear. Yeah. And he's got these long feet and the long arms. Yeah, you don't see that size very often oh, in the no. early bears. And the neat thing is, is that, that survived. Yeah. I mean, some little kid would have crunched that up, but this, they took care. He really, he really is cute. And these are just so wonderful for your dolls to hold and to be in the doll cabinet. And this guy. Oh, so sweet. He's so cute. 
Okay, I think we have this, a sold on this. Oh. Is this our four inch bear? Yes. Okay, Valerie. Okay, Valerie. Okay. Valerie, you really are. Valerie's, you, Valerie's got her, her shopping she's shoes the winner. on. <laughs> this is a Kramer from the 1930s. Look at his face. Kramer was a company in Germany and their bears were beautiful. They oh, did animals, wonderful. dogs, bears. They did the toy bearkins with the little embroidered mouth on that is so fantastic. They did great tipped mohair. This is an early gold one from the early 30s. He's in beautiful condition and he's $800. He's $800, oh my gosh. Look at so him, sweet. isn't he wonderful? Such nice condition. And he just has that beautiful, sweet, calming face that you just know he knows your stories and he's gonna give you great advice. And he's in just beautiful. Everything here that I'm seeing is just so well, okay. so then, well loved. I decided we, oh my gosh. we needed a dog. Get out of here. This is this so is tubby. fun. Tubby, this is a big tubby. This is a bigger size tubby. And he is from uh, about 1930, I think we're all familiar with Tubby and Fifi. Tubby was made by the Einco Company, with, which was children, and they did a wonderful program in England about Tubby and Fifi and the Children Toy Company and Einco. So it was really neat to learn about all the different um, things they made and the sizes. So he's $600. and So rare. You know, if he doesn't sell, I don't care. He may just go in my case and I'll eat beans for a week. It really doesn't matter. Oh, he's I worth eating tubby. beans over. Look at his original felt tongue. Look at that. A tubby Isn't is he? a must. A big old tubby. <laughs> and he's in great condition. Look at his mohair. Oh, he's amazing. Yeah. Isn't he great? An absolute must. Yeah, I, I love, love Tubby. Him. Tubby's pretty special. Good old Tubby. Yep. I'm Everybody's gonna, I'm gonna, gonna hold, have a tubby. Oh, I'm gonna hold tubby I for a while because he's water. So oh, that's okay. That's okay. It's just water. As I just spill all over Rachel's store. Oh no no. Let's see. It's happened before. This. Oh, this. look at this guy. This is guy it would be from England. He's probably from the 30s. Tubby sold. Oh, Not tubby. oh tubby. You know what? So, okay, I thought wait. Julie was gonna buy no, tubby. No wait, there's three. Somebody got in before Julie, I think. Oh, here we can go we back and go say back, we're the first so we tubby. Don't have a okay, Susan Davis. Susan Davis said was tubby the sold first, first one. Okay. Sorry, sorry, so Julie. If, if, sorry, yeah. Bev. Yep. Sorry. Congratulations, Susan. Congratulations, Susan. <laughs> yeah. That is how it works. Tubby, it, you're it's very popular. like an auction. Tu I know. Yeah. I'm sorry I don't have three of them. Oh, okay. Let me go well, look around in Rachel's store some yeah, more. Let's see what else we could find. Here. This is a wonderful Farnell, probably from the 30s. Look at this face from England. Isn't he great? He's great. I love his eyes. He's about, I'd say he's about 14 inches, 12, 14 inches. And he's 495. Isn't he great? He's fantastic. Oh, Bev says she was first. Well, you know, we're going to go look back. And, we, we can see exactly yeah, when the comments yeah. came in. But he is just marvelous. Yeah. And he's four ninety five. I just love him. He's so squishy and so wonderful. I love those older English bears. They have such great look. They look very stoic and very brave and very sweet. Like they're going to protect you through every single nightmare. I can attest to how squishy and wonderful they are. So if you need, if you need firsthand advice, yep. Um, yep. he is here for you. Yep. He's oh, wonderful. He's I love his. He reminds me of like an older, an older bear. Okay. His little cut. Look at his little, that. little ruffled nose. His sweet little mustache. And then this guy is wonderful. He's from about 1930s, 1933. He's an he's an old stife with his original button. So he's from the 30s, and he's about I'd say 16 inches tall, and he's incredible. And he's sixteen hundred and fifty dollars. But look at his condition. Mm, amazing. Look his pads, everything. He's just gorgeous. He is I awesome. Love, I love the look on that. Ooh, look that, at that. Yeah, that era is just really wonderful. This is wonderful. Yeah, look at him. Absolutely. He He's a dream bear. He is he super. Really is. Yes, he is. Oh, I love him. Yeah, isn't he great? He is great. Okay, and see. what else is in my little case we here? We are swooning out there, aren't we? <clears throat> And I love this little bear. He's awesome. Ooh, oh, oh my God. The hump. This the hump. wonderful little bear has hardly, I mean, he's got a sweater because his hair is thinning like mine. 
He has male pattern baldness like I do. Oh. And he's Horseman. Horseman was an early company. They made dolls, but they also made bears in around 1906. In fact, they were the first one to advertise teddy bears in the magazine, in Playthings Magazine, was Horseman, Horseman Toy Company. So he's an early one, <clears throat> but you gotta see this. His hump. The hump, the, everybody. You have to get the bear just for this yeah. hump. This is incredible. And he's $200. What a steal. Yeah. He, he wants to go to a good home. Oh, I love him. Yeah, he's just, he's just got that face like, I, I love you. It might be a she though, and, look at the card again. Well, I guess men wear cards. In here, see? His thread just needs to be tucked back oh, over. Oh, he's, <clears throat> he's so special. I'm gonna hold him up so we can <clears throat> go ahead. John, do you yeah. here, grab. No, I'll we, lick we it get, off the floor. We get so excited. I spilled my water, I have to lick it off the floor. We, we can get, we can also get him another. Another See, bottle. when you talk as much as I do. Well, it's very exciting. This is all very, dry. very, very exciting. Um, <clears> this <throat> is a this is a very sweet, sweet, sweet bear. And this, uh, somebody needs to buy this immediately because this gives you, you get the look of a wonderful teddy bear for only $200. And see, for me, I really like Worn and Loved. I really do. Oh, my goodness. Here, Speaking of Worn, worn and, and loved. loved. Here's a little stife. He's probably from yeah. around 1912, 19 to 1920. He's so cute. He's white. Oh. And look at, Bless he him. has had his hair just loved. Oh, oh my gosh. He looks the, like a mouse. The horseman bear is from about 1906. They were very early, 1906, 1907. So this little stife, he has his button. This is what amazes me. They lose their hair, they'll lose their tags, sometimes lose their eyes, lose their nose and mouth, but they'll have that button. Go that on, button, that puppy was in there. When I was little in our stuff toys, mom would take the buttons out and put them in a jar because she thought, you know, I guess she right. thought we were stupid children that would take them out and swallow them. So they came out and got put in a jar because, you know, she was afraid we'd be stupid and swallow our buttons. This guy. Look at him. He's 300. Oh, he, he this is a must he oh my god isn't he wonderful look at the, just look at it long nose very the old long man. nose well that's why i said he almost looks like a mouse just because like he, yeah <laughs> isn't he great oh my gosh he's great i just love him oh i love him 300 he, yeah he's, oh, he's, he's the size of the rattle bears you have to say sold if you want to get yeah, him say sold say sold and who him. it is you can say sold old man bear yeah he's so wonderful yeah. Oh, I love him. Isn't he cute? Yeah, it would be a super doll bear. I know. Talk about I mean, personality. That's, that size I really love because they really work great in the arms of a bear or a doll. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Okay, oh. so Paula. Okay, that works too. Yep. Okay, Paula. <laughs> this I, is to Paula. I know where to ship it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think I'm going to move into Paula's house. I think what I'm just going to do is go across the country. She said and, sold old man. Okay. <laughs> Are you referring to me? <laughs> so I'm just going to sneak into people's homes and they'll never discover that I'm there until it's too late. Well, I think that I works could, for me. I'm telling you, Rach, we can just pack a bag. He's a great house Off guest, I go. I'll tell you what. We, we're just, we live okay. here now in the Bear Den. So if you're here with us, please do us a huge, huge favor and share the video. That helps us so much so that we can get the message out there about our bears. Okay, and then we'll Look do a this. few more. Oh my and gosh, then there's I'm a pig. I'm gonna show you teddy bear pictures because I, I love those. They're one of my favorite collections and it, I have bazillions, so I have to weed out a few because just because I have been called a hoarder. Yeah. Yeah, no, Rachel, none of us are. H word. Oh, no, no, no. Someone mm -hmm. opened mm -hmm. one of my closets when they visited one time. And just because I probably have, you know, maybe four or 500 banker's boxes in that closet all the way to the door, they looked at me and said, I hate to use the H word. Oh, we're not hoarders. We are collectors. Yeah. And we are right? accumulators. Accumulators. Yeah. We are saviors of yeah. things. Yeah, that's what it is. You know who you are. You know who called me a hoarder. So <laughs> this is a bear from my childhood. Because I'm a child of the early 60s, and this is what I remember. The original teddy bear from the 60s, he still got his button and his flag. And I'm going to give you a deal on him, $50. $50, $50 get out of here. $50, yeah. Oh, get out of here. Because I, I just wonderful. love these. Thank you, everyone that's sharing so the video. We hear, wonderful. we see us sharing. Thank you, thank you. He's just, I love $50. these. $50. Original teddies from the 50s and the 60s. I've... I have weight more than anyone should ever possibly have, but that's okay. I'm not going to apologize. He is 
awesome. Oh, Isn't what a steal. Great? Oh, I wish I had 300 of them because then we could just have a little gift. Oh, with... wouldn't that be nice? A convention souvenir. A little convention souvenir. Yeah. That's right. Oh, he's great. Somebody's definitely going to buy him. Yeah. Thank you for sharing the video, Beverly. Okay, and the other thing I brought. Oh, look at that. Yeah. So, okay, when so I was fun. little, one of my very first teddy bears was Zadi. Zadi has a squeaker inside. This one's been squeaked out. But when I would go to bed at night, I would squeak my Zadi, and he told me I was the very best boy in the entire universe. So you are. Every night I would go to bed, and I would squeak him. Oh, We got a sold on John's teddy. Is, that, is, is this one? Because John has a lot of teddies. So... <laughs> Pick a teddy, any teddy. Pick a teddy, any teddy. So, yeah, you got to be a little bit more specific on that. Okay, yeah. You got to be more specific. So, and, say, and when you email John, you have to, you have to, when we're getting a lot of solds. You got to be specific, lot, everybody. Please say sold whatever it is. Whatever it was. So we okay. don't duplicate it and people don't hate me and right. hunt me down. Well, yeah, exactly. So, anyway. This is so cute. I love Zadi because Zadi told me I was the perfect child. So I want everybody to have a Zadi, and this is such a great little size. And he, again... I want you to know he's fifty dollars. John. Yep. Yep. If I was if I wasn't gonna be greedy, I'd be buying these right now, but it's not fair. This is so yep. wonderful. And he's got his little chest tag. Okay, first person to say sold in Zadi gets this wonderful guy yep. for fifty. What a gift. Thank yeah. you. I mean, I can't mean, even <laughs> buy a new bear for fifty. No, you cannot. He's wonderful. Love. Okay. Oh, and I love this. And this pig is from about 1920. This is a great. It's got his original button, as you can see. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love pigs. I was raised on a farm. People don't realize this about me. I was born and raised on a farm. I was up at five milking cows, feeding chickens, slopping pigs. I can dig a post hole like nobody else. Just want you to know. I now just do it in Gucci shoes. <laughs> so He's got great Gucci shoes, by the way. So. This wonderful Stife pig this is, is 300 and we're going to say $25. 325 Yeah. With the button, I thought it was going to yeah. be way more than that. Well, this is because I'm at Rachel's. Oh, Zadi sold. Well, this pig is absolutely wonderful. Pigs go really well pigs. with dolls. Look at his nose. Oh, he's great. Pigs are very smart, by the way. Oh, the, I love pigs. They are. I absolutely love pigs. And I'm yeah. going to tell you a story, and please, people, don't judge me and don't be angry at me, but this... Oh, the pig is sold, but oh, I'll still... Andrew. Oh, hi, Andrew. Hey, Andrew. I'll still tell you the story. Good to see ya. Being raised on a farm, you know where the pigs were going to go. Uh, yes, and that's, yeah, that would be very difficult. Yeah, and it difficult. was very sad. So every year, us kids got to name the pigs, and so one year, because um, I named him Mary Joseph and Baby Jesus. Because who's going to send away, send away Mary Joseph and baby Jesus? I couldn't do it. I love. So um, they remained pets for a very long time. Smart. I'm a smart kid. He always figures out how to, how hey, to make it. This work. little guy's going to go to he England. He is sold. Andrew, hi. Nice to see you. One of our bear buddies okay. out there. And then, oh, what, isn't he sweet? He's so sweet. This is an early American teddy, probably around nine, I'd say between 1910 and 1920. I just loved his look, and he, I love his little his little long johns here. And oh, he, he is. He's $200. $200. What is A lot of early American bears are unidentifiable as far as to company because they churned them out in the thousands. They didn't mark them. A lot were made in small sweatshops or small factories. They were sold to jobbers. They were sold to department stores. So you really never will know who made them. So he's one of those. He was just one of the small companies. And a lot of these didn't do a lot didn't last a long time so they're very very rare but he's he's two hundred dollars what a steal he just he has such a cute little expectant look so <laughs> i i just love that he's waiting for his yeah. afternoon he's just snack. very happy yeah he's he wants a piece of your john cake is what yeah. he wants well probably so oh he's mm -hmm. wonderful he is fantastic okay and we're gonna zip through thank you for you being here what? with we us so uh share the video do. we have we have a lot of live viewers out right now because of your wonderful sharing of this video so thank you so okay. much you know thank what you so we're much. gonna do what? we're gonna go to the pictures okay because we just we have some more but i'm, I'm worried about our time okay oh well are, yeah. are are you guys are you guys worried about it i mean we gotta go but we're having so much fun aren't we <laughs> oh i love these and in january in January. There's going to be fantastic things to buy. We're going to have wonderful shopping in January. Yeah. Oh, yes. It's going to be really special. It's going to be okay. amazing. One of my absolute passions is pictures of children 
with their toys. Oh, this is so sweet. Look at this. Oh, yeah. It's hopefully, a little boy. Hopefully they can and see. And it's hard because the light ring is going to reflect. Yeah, see if you can Look kind of, at him yeah, with there. all his toys. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's so sweet. With the little dog yep. and little horse. And just say, just say picture with little boy and toys. And it's... He's got little rabbits. Oh, and there's an elephant yep. and a horse and a dog. This is wonderful. How much is this? Fifty dollars. Fifty dollars. That is a great. It's, my oh, walls are it's, overflowing. They're wonderful for your doll and uh, teddy bear rooms. I mean, they're just oh, you could put them in the bathroom. They're so cute in a bathroom. And I love this one. Someone oh, went to a lot of t trouble to let's see if I can. This is a little girl with her bear, and on the other side, it's like a. Oh, a, and look at the diptych. Look at right there. And there's another one that they put with the two bears. Oh, that's so sweet. And it's a hundred dollars for the framed, so you can see the frame. Oh, that's such a good deal. With the two, with the two. I'm, that's such a. Are, are you? Yeah. How much is shipping on that? Um, you know, I'm including shipping. Oh, well, you guys, this is such a good deal. Yeah. That's like to get the shipping included. You, you just should really, you should really be getting everything right now. It's hard to get out in the shop, so this is quite the opportunity. Oh, he's got. Oh, look at that. Okay, these are very special. Oh, this is good. This is cute. This little girl is in a beveled a beveled glass in the metal frame. Look how and sweet. The light ring is good, but look at this bear. Can you oh see the gosh, bear yeah. or the reflection? Look yeah, at they that. Can, we can see it. Look at her in the metal frame. Oh. And it's large, as you can see by my head. It's pretty large. It's probably over 12 inches tall and about 12 inches wide. And it's $200 for this. Oh, what a, what a great And it's one of those accessory. beautiful tinted old pictures. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you don't see them very often. But the way, a great way to identify antique bears is to get old photos and things like that. And if you can get a bear with provenance and the child mm -hmm. that with it, it's so much more fun. You got to see where Teddy came from. You got to see what they... You know, it's just really wonderful. This is the kind of things that you need to, that, that we don't think about buying, but when you see a greatly presented okay. collection, this it one. makes it. It makes it. I love this one. It looks like a Kathy Cruz The last doll. one was 200 Yeah. Oh, this is cute. It looks like a Kathy Cruz doll, but it's actually a child oh, outside, out. probably his farmhouse in the middle of Nebraska, holding his precious teddy. Get this out. Is this is very so large. cute. This is probably, uh, I'd say, a foot and a half by a foot wide in this fantastic metal frame. And this is 250 That is such a good deal. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I love this. I mean, this. it's really hard to find the ones with the curved glass. Again, these go great in the yeah. in the back but of bathroom doors. Does that look like doors. a little early... Number one, Kathy Cruz. Judy Fox bought the tinted girl, a tinted picture okay. with the bear. Okay. And then Valerie bought this one right oh, here. Wow. So good buys, ladies. These are fabulous. This is fabulous. Okay. So, and what you guys need to do also when you when you buy something is shoot shoot John an email right now, and we'll get the we'll get the emails in there. And this one I love. And it's jpport at earthlink.net. Yeah. Or just yell, hey, you, and I'm usually close by. This is cute. This is, and I have this on Ruby Lane right now, but this is a little girl with her rod bear. I wonder if you can with see. With her rod it's bear? It's a rod bear. Oh, my goodness. Can you see it in the corner? Let's see, right there. Can you see if I, yeah, see the rod bear? On the back, it's Philip Dillon Jordan, and they're, and he's posing at Christmas with his bear. And they, so they said about 1905, 1906, he passed away in 1980. This is but, the kind of ephemera that you need. I don't know if the picture is a little foxy or if it was actually snowing outside. Either way, the rod bear is gorgeous. And she's in the most beautiful, probably a teddy bear coat. I love that outfit. I mean, isn't that awesome? And it's $100. $85. $85? $85. Yeah. Stop it. It's just so wonderful. That is wonderful. And then this one, the wire I pulled off. But look at these little girls with their teddy bear. Oh my gosh, so yeah, sweet. Yeah, look at this. And it's $35. $35? $35. I'm like, I'm screaming here. I know. John, she's, this is, she's I know. She's scaring me to death. <laughs> this is crazy. Look at this one. He has got the most incredible old bear next to him. So to describe him, you just describe like 
rod bear picture, oval picture with pink background. Just so we know, so we don't send you the wrong thing and you're totally disappointed. And make sure to email John. Oh, that is cute. And tell us, who's that little bear right there? This little bear, I think, is an early American bear. I don't think, well, no, it might be stife. It's, he might be cinnamon. The reason he's dark, he's probably a cinnamon stife. Oh, that's Isn't fun. Isn't he wonderful? He's wonderful. $35. $35. Cinnamon Stife, if you want that. That's, that's fabulous. And I could be here all day, but I'm only going to pick out a few. Okay, this one is actually a photo postcard. And look at this white Stife. And look at this little girl in her teddy bear coat and tri-corner hat. I love that hat. And this is dated 1907. And it says, Marion will be home with in a few days and it's $25 look at this isn't that great isn't that beautiful you can get that can you imagine getting that bear and the outfit to match spoiled little creep that would have been us I but... know it would have been we should just <laughs> shut up <laughs> we're like could you imagine what that it would have been like except... my mom had a doll show one time bought it one of the teddy bear sweaters I, I oh okay, Judy postcard. bought the postcard okay, sold Judy. to Judy Fox um and I'll tell you, she spent more on that teddy bear and sweater than she had ever spent probably on all of my clothes put together. I love it. Yeah. I love it. But that's okay. I still have it. It doesn't fit, but that's okay. Oh, that one's cute. This one? Yes. This one I, I had blown this. up. I love this that. This is 20 or $12 is actually all it is. I had that blown up oh, and cute. I'm going to have Rachel, she can keep it in the shop or do something with it. And it's the cutest thing oh, with yeah. the teddy in the little wagon and that baby. Isn't that, that is wonderful? so sweet. I love that. Yeah, I just I love, love those. I love that. So that's what I say. Look through boxes of of toys be, and boxes of old photos. Oh, You'd yeah. be amazed how many have children with this one I love. Oh, she's great. Oh, and this one too. He this has I a lot of them here. So if I do. You know what? I'm not good because we got so much to do. I'll just do a couple more. Look at this lady in her beautiful outfit with her teddy bear. And she's so pleased with isn't it. Isn't she wonderful? She's yes. $6. But isn't she wonderful? And we could also do like a mystery postcard too because they're yeah. all wonderful and looking at them. And if they sell, then just email John and say mystery postcard and he'll yeah. send you one. You just send him the money and he'll send you one. And, and they're all girl, great. This girl I just love because of her attitude. Check out the attitude on this child. Look at her with her legs crossed. I'm I'm pretty special. Oh, Holding yeah. her teddy bear. Oh, yeah. She's, well, she's set. She's got her yeah. teddy bear. She didn't have to worry about anything else. And no. she's six dollars. Just put so cute. girl with attitude. Oh, girl with hat is clothes. Julie Ryan. But I think we already sold it earlier than that. So what we're going to do with the sold things. The very first person to comment gets it. The ones after that, even though you didn't see the first person that commented sold on it. I apologize. I'll try and find you something else, but we have to go with the first sold. Yes, and yeah. and it and they are in order of when yeah. they were done. So thank you so much for yeah. understanding and being yeah. flexible with us. Okay. But with these, you can yeah. say mystery postcard, and then you'll just get a great post postcard. There you go. There you go. Anyway, girl with attitude. You could also just bear. send him five hundred dollars and say mystery bear. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> He'll he's got great deals. Okay, and I'm going to make that the last one because we have a full day. I see I see another bear in there. Okay, one more bear. I I'm, I can't let this... I can't... We've got one a lot of people bear. here. Oh, I think we should see all of the bears. This is American. And what I like about him, see the pointed paw pad, how it goes up? A lot of times Ideal did that. They were pretty well the very first one to do the pointed... It's It's almost like it points up. So this is not Ideal. Ideal was copied in the early 1900s by several different companies. He's in great condition. He has shoe button eyes. His nose is beautiful. His paws are beautiful. Except somebody did a great professional repair right here. It was not me, but they did a really great, they matched the felt so nicely. And he's early. And he's got five claws. Oh, how great. Yeah. How much and is he's he? $500. He's $500. He's Isn't wonderful. Isn't he wonderful? He is fantastic. If you want to take home a bear, um, any of John's that he brought are yeah. wonderful. So he's definitely pre-1907. Well, 1907, 1906, somewhere really? around there. So yeah. you could spend $500 yeah. and get a bear that's over 100 years old. Yeah. Well over 100 years old. Yeah. He's that's got such wonderful. an incredible face. Oh, he's great. He is. He's just really special. Now, John, are there any more bears in that suitcase? I, I don't. Just a couple. Well, I think okay, we should more. see them. Don't right. you think All we right. should see them? I think we okay. should. 
All right. I think we should. I just hate. You know, we got. I don't want to take up Rachel's whole entire day. She's uh, a very um, busy woman. We're excuse me. We're doing bears today. So I've invited her to come to my house like forty-seven thousand times. I want to do that. Very busy. Well, today is all about bears. Even though she went to the doll uncles and she was literally an hour south of me, did I get my feelings hurt? No. I just said, you know, if you could ever make it up to my little house in the woods, I'd be <laughs> so happy to have you there. Okay, we're going to the house in the woods. Oh, this is great. This is wonderful. This was made probably by Kuno Otto and Dressel in Germany around, I'd say around 1920, somewhere around there. It's made out of a burlap fabric. Can you see that? He's got his original collar and he has a muzzle, which I'm sure some people would love to put on me. But look at that. <laughs> like an old circus bear, he had the muzzle, unfortunately. And he's got these really wonderful old metal wheels oh, on a wood great. platform. And he's t he's $200, but isn't that neat? Look at this, with his glass eyes. Diana Vining just said, I mean, she built you a house. I know. <laughs> oh, this is cute. And how yeah, much was that, he? I missed it. He's 200. 200? Yeah. What a great accessory. Yeah. Isn't he super? Oh, yes. I love the shape on him. He's got a oh, great shape. Oh, he's wonderful. Shape. Oh, okay. Great little accessory. And then we'll just he do He just glides one, right along. One more. Gotta have that. This was made by Deem in Germany in the 1950s. What I love about this guy, and he's $600, or no, $500. Oh, he's cute. He, look at the brilliant, brilliant, almost oh, like yeah. a rusty, blondish rust. Such beautiful condition. A lot of these were, um, oh, we just sold to Julie the Kuno Auto and Dressel. Great buy, Julie. He's wonderful. A lot of these were mistaken for Shuko before we had a lot of identification happening. So he is, look at the mohair on the foot pad. But this is Diem, D-I-E-M, and it was a company from Germany around the 1950s into the 60s, but he's, I think, probably from the 50s. Look at this face. Oh, he's so fun. One time I tried to dye my hair blonde and it came out like that. Oh, well, see, you could have matched. Yeah. <laughs> so he's $500. He is wonderful. Isn't he fantastic? Oh, I just And he's it. a big guy. Look at his little butt. He's probably around, I'd say, 18 inches, maybe, maybe even 20. A good size. But I love the collar. So what is one of your favorite things that we've shown today? If yep. you've been on the whole video, we love hearing from you. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Is there anything else in there? Because there's just I, one more little one. I still one. see oh, more no. bears and we, I am a shopper. We got to shop. Okay. I see two. Okay. We'll do I see three. two more. Okay. This is a little original Stife teddy bear from the 1950s. He's got his original flag and clip script button. So you can see that. He looks like he just came out of the store. He's wonderful. He's $60. $60. $60. All right, if you want him, then you say- Hillary says, bring out a Bing, John Port. Did you bring any Bings? Oh, I didn't, Hillary, because I'm saving them all for you. <laughs> he's bringing them, he's, he's got a lot of wonderful uh, things, which he will be- Billy says, don't stop, Billy Harris. Please, more bears, don't stop. Because we know stop. that's just because she has no life. So oh, <laughs> this is fun. This is so fun. And we love sharing with I'm just you. Amazed. Okay, Lauren. People are Lauren tuning in to see me yap on. Oh, stop. We have been so excited. Okay, so Lauren, sold. you Lauren bought Lauren said first. So this oh, is the original Teddy. Okay. okay, so that is sold. Okay. To Lauren. So, but but we have Okay, Lauren, you, since you said first on that one, and Catherine, I'm so sorry. I do have another one. So the gold one. So Catherine, okay, so if let's go you, down to okay. So Lauren said it first, said and then first. Catherine Greenleaf said it second. So Catherine, if you want this gold one for sixty, you can have the gold one for sixty. Just say sold, Catherine Greenleaf, because I I know it's it's hard doing it this way, and I don't want people disappointed. But believe me, we couldn't list them all on our website yeah. first and this stuff is like, like an that. impromptu so, type yeah, thing. Yeah, it's just kind of I said bring a suitcase of bears, and we're just kind of having fun. So. Yeah. Um, thank you for understanding yeah. that we can't. Yeah. That it's a little bit different from usual. Yeah. And we, we just gotta stay flexible and happy for yeah. each other. And we just wanted to break up the day where we're working like yeah. to death here with just bringing eating. you in yeah. and giving you a chance to take some stuff home. I I am working him hard, so he's doing yeah. a lot of a lot of fun so, things. So we got that. Okay. okay so who, All right. who is that it? That's it. That's it. We are done. Okay. So if you enjoyed this, then please share the video because we love to get out there. And then we have been having the best time here. And we really appreciate yeah. you spending some time with us. Yeah, John, yeah. what's your what's been one of your favorite things of today? Oh, wow. Um, the cabin. The cake. The cake. 
<laughs> if you have not seen that cake, oh my God. The cake was, the cake was yummy. Wow. I mean, I've been overwhelmed all day. Aww. Rachel, you are the best. You are a treasure. You are the best. He is a treasure. We have so much fun and we really so, appreciate all of you. Just to let you know, we're gonna stay in this business until we're kind of old and doddering and can't remember anything. So you'll see us for many years to come, God willing. And do you know how we you can know. stay in that business is by people like you. Yeah. It sounds like the the PBS thing, but it's true. Yeah. When you share our videos and, and, yeah. and join the conversation, that means so yeah. much. It's like a family. We all get together. We all get to chat. We all get to enjoy stuff together. We have a shared addiction, I yes. guess we would call it. So that's what makes it exciting for me, you know? So thanks for tuning in. Every time you tune in, you know, it makes us feel like we're all part of each other's lives. Exactly. And I really enjoy exactly. it. It's very important for us to do this right now. So yeah. live from the Teddy Bear Den yep. or signing yep. off from the yep. Teddy Bear Den. We will see you very soon. Okay. And thank you so much for spending okay. the afternoon with us. Okay. Bye. Bye. Take care.